I teach theater, so um, theater uh, is about failure through and through. Rehearsal is a process of, uh, of failure. One of the things that we take from uh, uh, as a mantra in our class comes from the National Theater Institute, which is a simple three-word phrase, which is risk, fail, risk again. I think I would probably say prior to coming to science and math, I was teaching in an alternative school with all students who were on 365-day suspension from their base schools, um, and I lasted there one year. Um, it was the best job I've had. It's one of the hardest jobs I've ever had, and I realized that it, it felt to me, at least at the time, if you weren't burning out, you weren't doing it right, and I did, and I had to leave, and I... Um, I felt pretty disappointed in that, um, in not being able to stay there. It took me a year later to get back into education, and um, a job came open here at the School of Science and Math for a drama coordinator position. There wasn't a theater teacher position at the, pro at the time. I had an awesome interview. Um, uh, I felt really good walking out of the room. I got a call um, from the Vice Chancellor for Academics at the time, um, who uh, said he really enjoyed our conversation, but um, they were going to go. Uh, another way and I knew who that person was and we were friends and we're still friends today. Um, but after leaving one job to come to another, uh, in a sense, um, uh, and to feel like I had nailed the part and this is what I wanted to do, I wanted to work with adolescents in making theater, um, that was a big setback for me, bigger than any part I had lost or not gotten prior to then. Um, and I sat with it um, and I um, got another job in the meantime, to make ends meet, um, I talked to my now wife, then um, partner at the time. Um, <clears throat> I talked to my theater mentor, who I grew up, who I wanted to be like to teach theater, um, and uh, and I realized that you know I, I wasn't going to be alone in that situation, um, and I waited and. Um, and sure enough, six months later, I got a phone call, and they asked me if I would come back in for another interview. Um, and uh, I said, yes, absolutely, let's do that. Um, and I came in, we had an excellent conversation. And um, while the job wasn't everything I'd hoped it would be immediately, um, through a, a year and a half of working here, um, we decided we were going to go ahead and create a theater program. So I take an ensemble approach to making theater. Um, and I think taking an ensemble approach to your life to create um, a, a group of people. So you're never failing on your own. Um, you're never alone when you do that in the process, uh, in a healthy rehearsal process, and I think in a healthy lifestyle. Um, you're always in a position um, where you have um, those folks who you can turn to, talk with, um, share with, that are going to help you do that. Part of the process is to stumble. Um, and all the sort of cliches are true, but I wish for you and um, uh, for all of my students, um, uh, you know, soft landings when they have to, when they can be, and um, a good, strong, positive support network of peers and hopefully teachers alike.